Hello, everyone. Bonjour à tous. It's a pleasure to share a few words with you as we work together to address the pressing issue of climate change. Over the past few months, we've all had to take action to slow the spread of COVID-19 and to protect our people. And as we continue to fight this virus, we also can't forget that climate change still remains one of the greatest challenges of our time. And in fact, COVID-19 and the climate crisis have a lot in common. Like the virus, the impacts of climate change are far worse for racialized communities, indigenous peoples, and women. Also, any failure to act immediately and decisively will only make the costs of these crises higher and worse over time. But this global pandemic has also created an opportunity to build back better, and climate action is an essential part of that. That's why we've been working with the UN Secretary General and Jamaican Prime Minister Holness to lead a collective and sustainable economic response to the pandemic. We're doing this to support the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. And later this month, we'll reconvene to discuss our progress and our next steps. Voilà pourquoi le Canada maintient son engagement à l'égard de l'Accord de Paris et de l'objectif collectif de mobiliser 100 milliards de dollars américains en financement annuel pour le climat. Mais nous devons en faire plus encore. Tous les ordres de gouvernement, mais aussi le secteur privé et le milieu financier, devront réorienter massivement, à une vitesse sans précédent, les flux de capitaux pour qu'ils soient en mesure d'atteindre nos objectifs ambitieux. Here in Canada, we're tackling climate change through a national price on pollution, and we invite more countries to join us through the Carbon Pricing Leadership Coalition. Canada is also co-leading the Powering Past Coal Alliance with the United Kingdom to increase the global transition to clean energy. And in our COVID-19 relief measures, we included climate disclosure as a key condition for large employers to access major loans. My friends, this pandemic reminds us of what we can achieve through collaboration. We came together countries, communities, and neighbors to work for our collective safety and well-being. That's a lesson we need to apply to the climate crisis. And you can count on Canada to be there in the fight against climate change in the months and years to come. Merci, mes amis.